Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Dolly's and welcome to, well, I guess something new. It's still Minecraft, but this is, if I hit F3, Minecraft 1.9. Um, so we are starting out a new world, um, so I might as well start collecting wood. I spawned this really cold biome. There is a birch forest. I kind of just took a look around my area. Not really moving much, but... Um, yeah, so this is my vanilla series. I'm I decided to start this um, mostly just to give me an excuse to do uh, more survival vanilla stuff. Um, I'm enjoying the modded series, and I I'm looking forward to get more into that and get more in depth into the mods and everything because um, it's still pretty early in that. But I I really want to kind of. Uh, span out all of my series a little bit, give me a little bit more option of what I can do in a week. Um, and this is one that I've, I've kind of wanted to do for a while. Um, the reason being is originally my server um, series was to just give me an excuse to do, um, oh wow don't want to go down there right now um, ooh, oak let's get some oak too uh, so the servers were originally intended just to give me uh, a way to do some big build projects that I have in mind um, but honestly the, the server with my friends no, nobody's on it ever I, I don't play it very often actually I haven't been on there for quite a while so there's really not much going on with that so I kind of decided just to step away from the server and I decided to do a single player vanilla um, as an excuse to do all of those builds that I want to um, oh yeah I, I do need to get open my inventory let's get a little bit of stuff normal minecraft stuff. Um, let's dig into some dirt. I need to get food. I want to explore this uh, ice plains because of the new structure in 1.9. Um, so yeah, this, this series is going to be all about kind of doing different builds and everything. Um, So it is going to be kind of random sometimes. It, I, it's, I'm going to mix this with my uh, modded series. So basically whenever I have stuff to do in either of them, that's when I'm going to do things. Um, let's just mine some, dirt, some stone for now. Uh, so I have a lot of ideas that I want to do. I want to get into actually making some uh, vanilla farms that I've never really messed with. So like. I've never made an iron golem farm. I've never made um, an automated sorting system or anything like that. You know, there's a lot of just technical redstone stuff that I want to do. Uh, I've never really done much building in recent memory. Um, so, like, uh, for example, w one thing that I, I have in mind, and I'm not going to go into too much detail with it, but. Um, a long long time ago it was Minecraft gosh what was it Minecraft uh, probably 1.2 ish somewhere around there in alpha um, I know that I saw some uh, pumpkins over here let's go grab some pumpkins but long time ago in Minecraft 1.2 alpha uh, I, I played around in, a, in just a normal world and uh, that it looks really cool over there um, and one of the things I did was I decided to dig out a complete chunk so a uh, at that time it was a 16 by 16 square and I did that from uh, surface level to bedrock just because I enjoyed the digging 
and honestly that was pretty much all you had to do back then. But with that, I ended up making a, uh, a gigantic stone tower, and that's something I kind of want to get back to. Um, I'm not going to dig like a bunch like I've done in the past, but let's grab some coal while we're here. Um, I do want to try to to recreate what that tower was supposed to be. Um, and eventually I will get there. Um, it's one of the, the big build, big builds that I have in mind. Um, speaking is another thing that I need to work on, but that's beside the point. Um, but no, so I want to kind of do some mega builds type stuff. I want to work more with redstone. I should probably not sprint right now. Um, just collect some stuff. I want to work more with redstone, I want to work more um, making vanilla farms, that kind of stuff. So just a, a bunch of stuff. I can make some mushroom soup. That might not be a bad first day uh, food source. I saw some pumpkins, but I lost them now. I think they're back this way. Um, not seeing any animals. They're squid. They don't count. They don't give you food. I hear sheep. Okay, if I hear sheep, then there they are. Let's kill some sheep. And I gotta remember, don't spam. Uh, which, early game, the axe is probably a lot better. I don't know for sure yet, though. Um, so let's, real quick, let's make a couple things. Let's make a furnace, and let's place that down, and get some mutton cooking. And then I want to go ahead and make, uh, with the gray wool. That is weird, I wasn't expecting that, that sound from the uh, furnace. So let's try to find the pumpkins. And I want to grab more everything. Uh, so I'm just trying to think of other things I, I, I want to do. I want to make you know, the Videla Farms, the, uh, the builds, um, both creative and redstone-y. Um, and just kind of explore what all I can do uh, in Minecraft. I also want to learn uh, how to deal with the uh, the new uh, mechanics with the fighting. Uh, and with that, I, I will eventually take on like Wither and uh, the Ocean Monument. Uh, I've never actually fought either of them in vanilla, like straight vanilla. Um, I like I, I've I've killed um, I've killed the wither in like diversity um, or and stuff like that. But I've never taken on uh, ocean monument. I've always been scared of that. There's a cow over there. Um, a lot of farm animal, animals, animals, I really can't speak <laughs> today at all, but, uh, no, so a lot of what I want to do is just kind of get used to all the new mechanics, um, figure out how, how to make Minecraft work for me again, um, and this will update as Minecraft does. Um, so, whenever there's a new snapshot, well, snapshots I don't know about yet, but when there's a new, uh, update, I will, uh, go ahead and do stuff with that. I like the new rain sounds. It's actually really peaceful. Um, but I want to sleep. And I like that I can see my feet. 
the small touches are actually really nice in this. Um, let's eat some food. Uh, if we make some more, let's use spruce, let's make some more sticks, and let's make just a handful of torches. I do want to try to get a sapling. And we'll see if we can't find some place to settle. Um, I am very bad about wandering. Um, cool. So I am very bad about just kind of wandering around aim aimlessly and not really knowing where to go. I don't know where those pumpkins are. Um, but that's not a big deal. We'll get pumpkins eventually. So I, I really do want to find a place to settle that I will like. Um, obviously, I am a huge fan of the mesa biome and I love the mesas. So I would not be... Oh, hey, bunnies. Uh, I would not be terribly sad if I found one of those. I do really like that mountain range though. But I also don't like living in mountains. Um, too much jumping. Although, uh, eventually I am going to settle kind of like with my modded series. I, I do plan on making a bunch of different smaller areas to do stuff in. Um, so that will be a thing eventually. Uh, so I and to that extent um, some of like I will I plan on making like a metropolis or something like that in the modded I will probably do something similar in vanilla um, just kind of for myself just to kind of figure out well what is it that's different that I that I'm changing with you know can I do similar things in modded as I can in vanilla or figuring that kind of stuff out free iron wow let's grab this stuff um, it's usually not too difficult to get completely equipped with iron at least on the first day um, at least not for me the biggest problem I usually have is uh, let's grab some more coal make sure there's nothing over here looks good uh, the, the problem I usually have is food um, but we found a lot of um, sheep and we found some pigs so at least for the time being we should be good um, and then we can get to work uh, getting fully equipped, getting enchants, getting overpowered very quickly um, one thing I am, I am keeping an eye out for trying to uh, for the new little uh, structure that's found in these plains. So I'm kind of glad that I, I spawned in the ice plains. I'm not a big fan of them. They're kind of barren. Um, except with the, the rabbits, the, the occasional jumping rabbits. Uh, nothing much there. But yeah, so like I might make an, a, a, like a metropolis and I might have um, different themed areas but not so much as in the modded series where I'm actually making things based around certain mods I probably won't do that um, and by the way this is gonna be a very talky episode uh, just because it is the first episode I'm just kinda exploring around seeing what's what's here I know I'm going in a big circle, but I'm also kind of doing that for a reason. I could go straight through this taiga, but I don't really want to. I'm still kind of looking for the any... Uh... Oh, igloos. That's what the structures are. Uh, there's cows over there. Let's not do the run jump thing, because uh, I don't have any more food on me cooked anyways um, but no so um, one of my other goals while I probably won't try to get all the achievements I might eventually um, go for that 
Um, but I know one goal that I'd like to do at the very least is try to get all the items in the game and even make it to a point where I can collect a large number of each of the items fairly easily. You know, some items are going to be very difficult in vanilla um, to get. Uh, wither skulls are fairly rare, so it's going to be hard to get a lot of nether stars, uh, especially with. Um, the new combat system. Let's come up here. If I can find a uh, an igloo, that's going to be very, very good because um, it's going to give me potions right away, or at least the uh, brewing stand. Um, but you do need blaze powder now, I believe. I don't know if that that change is still in. But I believe you need uh, blaze powder in order to use the uh, brewing stand. Uh, but I don't know. We'll find out. That's not going to be a big deal. But no, so I would like to be able to. I would like to have storage of a lot of items, just a big storage room, and that will probably be in the metropolis because that makes the most sense to me. Alright, so we're going to have to stop and cook food here in a little bit. I'm not seeing any place that really stands out to me. Um, it's all this snowy biome. And I'm not too big on snowy biomes. I usually like to settle either in uh, plains, mesas, or deserts. Uh, those are usually the, the uh, chosen biomes for me. Uh, so let's... Yeah, let's gather some sand for right now, uh, just a little bit. See if there's anything around. There's a squid. This valley's kind of cool. Like I like this area, but it's it's not one place that I really want to settle. At least not to begin with. Um, especially not with food being uh, as scarce as it is. Let's actually grab some snowballs. Because um, if we can um, make a snowman, um, a snow golem, then we can uh, make plenty of snow later. I really like the uh, the furnace has new sounds. At least I think it does. So let's yeah, let's jump up here a little bit. Uh, we could use some more wood, so let's go ahead and chop down a tree while we wait for the rest of the food to cook. I'm gonna have to make another bench, uh, crafting bench, in order to get the achievements. That's not a big deal though. Uh, a lot of sand there, and I don't know if it's because of this little river or what, but. Ah, uh, where it is. There it is. Alright, let's get going again. Uh, let's just keep going this direction. See what we can find. Um, these episodes aren't usually going to be terribly long. Um, this one might be a little bit longer than I anticipate. Uh, just because I'm trying to find... Like I said, trying to find a place to settle. Um... Let's go this direction-ish, because it looks like the birch forest. I don't like settling in birch forest too much. Okay, it must be the rabbits that I hear. Or I guess it's not a birch forest, it's just a forest. Um, so this should be an okay way to get back up and out. Um, planes are great because of the uh, the horses. And I'm trying to hear if there's anything underground. Any mobs. Um, looks like this does go into a normal planes. That wouldn't be terrible to start off almost night as well. Let's come up on this hill. 
Lots of trees nearby. There is a village right over there. That, I think, is a good place to start. So let's go check out this village, and then I might actually call the episode here. Um, there is a zombie spawner down here. Yeah, there is a zombie spawner. I do not know that I'm ready for a zombie spawner. Alright, let's get down here very quickly. At least I think there's a spawner. Maybe not. Zombie villager over there. There's just a lot of zombies. Uh, let's sleep real quick. Um, the only thing I don't like about settling in villages is I, I really feel like I have to protect the villagers. And I'm terrible at that. So that is my only hesitation about coming over here. Uh, but there is plenty of food. So that issue is kind of solved. This is relatively large. It looks like a relatively large uh, village. Alright, that new sounds. Alright, you know, have a light, and we're gonna lock you in. Uh, what kind of crops do we have? We have carrots, wheat, normal wheat. We have two bookshelf places. Don't really care about their trades. Yeah, new sounds. Really throws you. There is a blacksmith. That is awesome. Um, so we have two furnaces. Let's go ahead and take these. Always good to have more furnaces. And what do we have? God, you scared me. <laughs> iron, iron sword, iron helmet. Let's put the helmet on. Uh, iron sword is nice. Uh, let's eat the bread. Uh, what can we do? We can tr combine the sticks, that's for sure. And where's my mutton? My mutton must be in there. So, nice. Um, so a decent amount of stuff in there. Um, you know, I don't like settling right with the, uh, the village. There's like lava underneath here. Or maybe I heard that delayed. Oh well, I really would love to protect these guys, but I don't know that I'm gonna be able to. Uh, so let's, real quick, let's just kind of look. If we go this way a little bit. Um, I didn't look at the other farms. I'll have to come back to that. I'll have to screenshot. And we have chickens. I kind of like that little cliff area. Um, maybe we can do something with that. Maybe that'll be our first little project. Uh, I know I didn't say. I know I said I didn't like settling in uh, mountains. But I think we can do something cool with this. So, I, hmm, I, w I really want to see what's just kind of over this horizon. There's pumpkins, yay. Um, so this doesn't look too bad. It doesn't look like anything can spawn up here. Um, but let's put a torch here, just in case. And let's just make a little hidey hole type thing. And this is where we're going to settle for the time being. Um, so I'll probably do a little bit of work off camera, not much, um, and get a, um, I have an idea for this area that I think would be cool, and it would be mostly wood, so that'll be fun. Um, so this is just going to be my little hidey hole area. Uh, we'll put the crafting bench in the corner and some furnaces, we'll... 
I don't know, we'll break this wall out a little bit more. Put it in the uh, air a little bit. And next episode, we're probably going to go mining. Um, let's take a look to see. It looks like we have an ocean that way. That's about all I can see. So, yeah, um, like I said, next episode, we'll probably go mining. Um, and, yeah, then we can start work on what I want to do with this. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye!